Um, so now my name is Matt Oyle. I'm studying business management and marketing at Leeds Beckett and this is my consumer vlog. Um, in this video I'll be looking at consumer buying behaviour to analyse my own behaviour using theory to see how decisions are made. Uh, to do this I've selected two products and services to see how my approach into getting these products or, or service differs. Um, the definition of consumer buying behaviour is the dynamic interaction of effect and cognition behaviour and environmental event by which human beings conduct the exchange aspect of their lives and the source of this is written on this uh, this page but I don't, don't know if you can see it because it might flip through the video so let's take a screenshot and flip it like sweet um, so anyway uh, my buying my my, my buying process can be stripped down into the funnel approach in which breaks down the process into problem recognition, information research, evaluation of alternatives, product choice and the overall outcome. Uh, so for me this would mean that the problem recognition would either be that the current product is broken or would need updating um, and so then the information research in which would mean that the product sort of I want or the style of product I want. Uh, the evaluating alternatives would be looking into other styles, products like the colours or depend, depend what the product is. Um, and then the product choice would be selecting the product in which I want to buy and to finish the outcome is buying and using said product. Uh, the products in which I would like to discuss are a holiday and just a pair of shoes. Um, I'll start with the holiday and so there isn't really a problem recognition for this other than I want to go on holiday. Uh, so for me, as I, I'm, I'm not about going on holiday on my own. Um, well, I'd, I'd just get bored on my own. Uh, so like I'd go with my friends or obviously if we're going on a family holiday, we're going on a family holiday. Um, so for example, like the last one, the last holiday in which we went to was Amsterdam. Uh, so for the information research, I looked at like comparing all prices, uh, normally package deals, and like the what facilities in which the hotel or Airbnb has in which uh, we're looking at staying in. As we are sort of a group of lads, we don't plan what we want to do in the country or place that we visit. Uh, it's more to go with the flow. So if we want to see a site, we'll go see the site. If we want to get a drink, we'll get a drink. It's just whatever we sort of want to do on, on that day with that, we, we just don't make a plan. Um, the evaluation of alternatives would be, in this case, looking at other holidays uh, whether it's like a beach holiday or a tourist holiday um, but for me I'd, I'd select something in the middle because I'm not like a mad tourist that wants to go sites and then I'm not just a beach person who just wants to spend all day on the beach just then it depends on how I feel in the, in the morning of that day really um, so so when I'm like looking at um, the package that you want to purchase um, so that the product choice would be picking. Yes, the product choice is picking where you want to go and the package you want to purchase. Uh, the final outcome would obviously be going on holiday, which I'm good at. Um, so for my second product, I have chosen a pair of shoes, um, which are bang. Uh, so to start with, the problem recognition I had was just that I needed a new pair of shoes because I've, I've never really owned sort of more than two. Like, I've always had like, just two pairs of shoes really. Uh, so just because I'm not, I'm just not into shoes, and I don't, I'm not made of money, so I don't just spend it all on fat, like load of shoes. Um, so, so yeah, that, that's about it really for my problem recognition. Uh, the information research into uh, the information research into what kind of. No, no. Nah, sweet. So the uh, the information research into sort of what kind of shoe I want or what would suit me as a although I'm not like into me fashion I still don't want to look weird and I just like keep it me because I care I'm not into copying people because you don't go on, you don't want to go on a night out and wear the same thing as your mate so just get up something that you like keep it what you like and I you know it's like what happened like that's all it is for my information research you look into it get what I get what I want uh, the evaluation of alternatives, so I chose obviously the colour blue for them vans. Um, 
choose the yeah choose the color blue as I as I just liked to, and I had and because I've, I've owned vans before, I knew that they were good quality and sort of would last a while. Uh, so actually, I, so actually, I suppose that that is a form of brand loyalty because I know it's going to be good quality. I know it's going to last me time. So I know it's going to be value for money. So I suppose that could have been why I subtly chose shops at vans again. Um, so the outcome is obviously the outcome is just buying and wearing the shoes and also knowing that I would buy vans again because I bought them again because they last a while even though they are like 50 quid something which for me is a lot of money but they, they last years do you know what I mean so it's not not sort of the end of the world um, so that's the end of my machine the vlog really safe <laughs>